under normal conditions, an appropriate amount of blood passing through the afferent arteriole causes an appropriate uh, blood pressure in the glomerular capillaries, which results in the appropriate uh, amount of filtrate being formed. Uh, it is not adaptive to have a filtration rate which is too high. In this case, valuable materials such as water, ions, glucose, etc. could be lost from the body. Nor is it adaptive to have the filtration rate be too low, otherwise uh, urea and nitrogenous waste would be retained in the body instead of being eliminated. If the blood pressure in the afferent arteriole is too high, then too much filtrate will be formed from the glomerular capillaries. The macula densa perceives this, that too much filtrate is being formed. As a result, the macula densa releases vasoconstrictor, a signal which will cause the constriction of the smooth muscle around the afferent arteriole. This reduces blood flow to the glomerular capillaries and thus reduces the amount of filtrate being formed. If there is too little blood pressure passing through the afferent arteriole, then there will not be sufficient blood pressure in the glomerular capillaries, and thus there will be a reduced amount of filtrate. The macula densa perceives this, and in response uh, will s uh, release less vasoconstrictor. When the macula densa releases less vasoconstrictor, uh, this will result in vasodilation of the afferent arteriole. With vasodilation, more blood and more blood pressure then reaches the glomerular capillaries. This results in more filtrate being formed and uh, thus homeostasis is returned. Uh, also, the specialized smooth muscle cells along the afferent arteriole will make renin, which is a hormone which will increase uh, filtration and help conserve water. Uh, renin increases blood pressure. Renin will cause the, uh, an increased secretion of the hormones aldosterone and ADH. This will cause increased water retention and increased salt retention. And all of these are adaptive in fighting a reduced uh, filtration rate.